Welcome you guys to the Woodside Home Channel. My name is Rebecca and today we're doing about a 10 minute Pilates routine. And I'm here in this nice covered area and I love bringing my workouts outside. You get this nice breeze, you're covered so it really protects your skin, but you still hear the birds and you see the sky and it's just a great place to bring your workout outside. So let's go ahead and get started. All you need is a mat and your own body weight. We're gonna do a quick little warm up. I want you to clasp your hands round and bounce and then open the arms and expand. Lift the chest to the sky, bounce and round and open and expand. Let's do that one more time. Bounce and round, open the arms, open the chest and then lower the arms, nod the chin. We're gonna do a roll down, soften the knees as much as you need to. Walk out into your plank. We're gonna do a quick body check. I want you to drop your heels down. I want you to engage your quads, glutes, check into your pelvis, your rib cage, push away. Take a deep inhale, our Pilates breath, and a nice long exhale. Let's stay here one more time. You got this. Inhale through the nose, and then exhale through pursed lips. Bend the knees to a quick child's pose, and then body wave to a bow shape, or supported spinal extension. I want you to glide the shoulders down, draw up on the abs, look over one shoulder, get a good stretch, over the other shoulder, look center, sit back and round. Articulate up, tail to head, and that was our quick warm up. We're gonna do our first exercise. Take a seat, we're doing a half roll back. Legs together, sit up nice and neutral. Tilt the pelvis, roll it down. Try to touch that lumbar spine to the mat. Exhale, think about a string attached to the top of the head and lift tall. Again, roll it down. And then exhale through, purse lifts, lift up nice and tall. We're gonna do one more here and then add on. Rolling it down, think about gliding the shoulder blades down the back. And then exhale, lift up tall. Now we're gonna add a rotation to that. Rotate and reach, sit up nice and tall. The other direction, rotate and reach, and sit up nice and tall. We're gonna do two more alternating sides. Try to keep that pelvis nice and squared. Engage the inner thighs and then grow tall back to neutral between each rotation. Exhale, sit nice and tall. One more, roll it down. Exhale, lift it right back up. Slide forward on your mat just a little bit. I want you to roll down to touch the lumbar spine and just the shoulder blades on the mat. Bring one leg tabletop other leg to meet it. We're gonna do everyone's favorite, the 100. Reach the legs out if you wanna up level, and then inhale, pump through the arms, and nice long exhale. Again, inhale, pumping through the arms, and nice long exhale. Let's do four more rounds in, inhale, and exhale. Shh. Inhale, now try to lift the legs up, and exhale, lower the legs, only as low as you can keep that lower back flat, and inhale, lift, and exhale, lower. We got this, three more, inhale, lift, and exhale, lower, keep pumping the arms, inhale, lift, and exhale, lower, we'll do one more round, and inhale, lift, and exhale, lower, hold it here, bend the legs, grab behind the thighs, Rock yourself up. And we're gonna flip around, stretch you out the other way for our swan dive prep. So you wanna turn your legs laterally and open through the chest. Glide the shoulders down, drop on the abs, lift up. And then lengthen through the crown of the head and lower it down. Glide the shoulder blades down and lift up. Lengthen through the crown of the head and down. Two more of our swan dive prep. Think about drawing up on the abs to protect that lower back. Think about gliding the shoulder blades down. No using your neck, lengthen through the crown of the head. We'll do one more here. 
Press it up and lower it all the way down. We're gonna counterbalance that with a child's pose and a shell stretch. So you round and lengthen out. C curve, round and lengthen it out. One more, roll it all the way up. All the way back up. We're gonna do part of our five ab series. Okay, we're gonna start with our scissors. You're gonna roll it back down, just the bottom of the shoulder blades touching, one leg at a time, tabletop. Reach the legs up. You're gonna pull one leg back towards you and switch. Think really long and strong legs. You can either pull behind the um, calf or the hamstring here. The main focus is that you glide the shoulder blades down. We keep this thoracic flexion where the bottom shoulder blade is touching the mat. Let's speed it up a little bit. Let's do five quick ones. Five, switch five, exhale four, four, three, three, last two, two, one more, one, one. Hug the knees in and relax it down. All right, that was your rest. Okay, we only got 10 minutes, so we gotta keep going. Tabletop, hands behind the head, thoracic flexion. We're gonna do oblique twists. We're gonna do three slow, rotate and reach. Inhale and exhale, other side. Slow and deadly. Inhale and exhale, the other side. And one more, really slow. And rotate, now five quick. Exhale, long inhale. Long exhale, long inhale. We got two more rounds, long exhale. Long inhale, one more round, stick with it. Long exhale, long inhale, and relax it down. Go ahead and slide a little bit forward. We're gonna bend the legs, lift the hips up. This is our shoulder bridge position. I want you to focus energy out through the knees, stabilizing your pelvis, knitting your ribs, and gliding the shoulders down. Work in that whole posterior chain of the body. Engage your right hamstring glute, float the left leg to tabletop, and reach it up. Try to keep the hips and pelvis squared and level. Flex and lower, point and lift. We're gonna do five more like that. Flex and lower, point and lift. Again, dorsiflex the foot lower, keep those hips squared. Point and lift, give me three more good ones. Flex and lower, point and lift. Last two, and lift, last one, best one. Flex and lower, point and lift, hold it. Bend to tabletop, articulate your foot. Lower the hips, I was being nice, we're resting. And that was our rest, back up. Engage your left hamstring glute. Float the right leg tabletop. Reach it up to the ceiling. Flex the foot, lower it down, point and lift. Dorsiflex and lower, hips and pelvis stay squared and level, point and lift. Inhale as you lower the leg, exhale as you lift. We got three more of these babies, down and lift. Last two, inhale and exhale, last one. And bring it up, tabletop the leg, articulate your foot, lower the hips down. Go ahead, turn to your side, make your way up. Okay, we're gonna do one more exercise on the mat. I want you to do kneeling, but line yourself up at the back of the mat. Reach the arms out to a T, reach the leg out. You're gonna lean and do a nice mermaid, a lateral flexion. Now lift the arm, lift the leg and then up and over, good long stretch. Lift the arm, lift the leg, and then mermaid it over. Give me five more, we got this, five. Up and over, and four. Lift up through the underside obliques, push through the mat, and then really good, a good stretch through that whole top side of the body. Last two, and over. Last one, hold it. For a bonus, circle the leg for five. We got this. And four, and three, last two, last one. Hold it all the way up and over. Push through the arm, come up. Ooh, felt a nice breeze there, I needed it. All right, reach the leg out, out to a T. 
Reach away, we're gonna do that beautiful mermaid, the lateral flexion. Then lift the arm, lift the leg. Up and over, draw up on the underside obliques. And lift. Five more here, get a good stretch. Try to really open through the chest and push through the mat. Drawing up on the obliques and stretching through the top side of the body. Let's go for three and lift. Up and over two and lift. One more, enjoy this stretch. Lift and hold, bonus, hand behind the head. Circle for five and circle four and three. You got this, two, one more, hold it. One more stretch, push through the arm and come up. We're gonna finish where we started in our plank. Okay, so come on to all fours. All 10 fingers spread apart. We're gonna come into a nice plank position. Let's do that body check again. Okay, drop into the heels. Engage your quads, glutes, abs. Push through the mat. Walk your hands back. Four, three, two, one. Soften the knees if you need to. Get a good last stretch. And then hands down. Bend the knees, roll yourself up. Woo, and we made it. Thanks for joining me for this quick, short and sweet Matt Pilates workout. And for more fitness content, go to our Woodside Home channel on YouTube and you'll have tons of great workouts with us.